Hello friend, welcome to my channel Quest for Education. Today I am discussing 10 mathematics questions for the student who is preparing for the Jahar Navadaya Vidyalaya entrance exam 2023. Let's start. And before we start, one thing I would remind you that don't forget to subscribe my channel. Question number 1. What is the difference between the largest number of 5 digit and smallest number of 4 digit? So friend, largest five digit number nine 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 smallest four digit numbers that is one zero 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 difference so friend nine 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 eight nine 98,999 So friend D is the right answer Question number 2 Simplify third bracket 16 divided by second bracket 42 less 38 plus 2 second bracket close third bracket close multiplied by 12 divided by first bracket 24 divided by by 6 first bracket close so friend we can write it 16 divided by first we calculate this this is 4 we add 2 it's we get 6 12 divided by 4 again third bracket 16 divided by 6 multiplied 12 divided by 4 so friend here 16 upon 6 multiplied by we divided got 3 2 2 8 so friend 8 is the right answer b is the right answer question number 3 find the value of 450 multiplied by 80 multiplied by 156 multiplied by 0 multiplied by 125 multiplied by 256 here if we closely watch the expression we find there is a 0 and if we multiply 0 with any number we got 0 so p is the right answer question number 4 5 minutes past 3 afternoon is written as so friend we can write it as a 305 because 5 minute we can write it 05 and it's afternoon so we can write pm so d is the right answer question number 5 the dimension of a hall are 24 meter by 12 meter how many square shaped tiles with 40 centimeter will be required to cover the floor so friend area of hall that is 24 meter by 12 meter we can convert it into centimeter so centimeter by 1200 centimeter area of tiles that is 40 centimeter so therefore tiles require we divide the whole area by tiles area so so friend zero 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 that is 1800 so c is the right answer question number six three number are in the ratio one ratio two ratio three and their a shape is 12 the number are so friend simply we can get the number by multiplying 12 with the ratio so the numbers are 12 24 36 so c is the right answer 
क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवन मोनो स्पेंड थर्टी परसेंट ऑफ इस सैलरी ऑन फूड एंड फाइव परसेंट ऑफ सैलरी ऑन चिल्ड्रन एजुकेशन इन जनवरी टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी वन ही स्पेंड रुपीज सेवेंटी थाउजेंड सिक्स हंड्रेड ऑन दीज टू आइटम्स हिज सैलरी फॉर द मंथ इज सो फ्रेंड सेवन मोनोज स्पेंड थर्टी on food 5% on education education so friend total spending 35% plus 5 that is 40 percent and in rupees total spending is 70600 so according to question 40 percent equal to 17600 1 percent equal to 17600 upon 40 and total that is 100 percent equal to 17600 multiplied by 100 upon 40 so friend thousands. so b is the right answer question number 8 a merchant offers 8% discount on all his goods and still make a profit of 15% if an item is marked rupees 500 then its cost price is so friend 8 mark price price that is 500 first he gives 8% discount so discount 500 of 8% that is 500 40 so so friend selling price is 500 less 40 460 he make a profit of 15% therefore profit 15% so cp selling price multiplied by 100 upon 100 plus profit percentage that is 460 multiplied by 100 by 115 so friend 520 so 220 400 so friend c is the right answer question number 9 selling price of 6 bananas is equal to cost price of 8 bananas then percentage of profit is let he can buy or sell of x rupees x so cost price cost price of 8 bananas is rupees x so cost price of one banana that is x upon 8 and selling price of one banana that is x upon 6 so profit x upon 6 less x upon 8 24 4x less 3x that is x upon 24 so profit percentage 
x upon 24 divided by cp that is x upon 8 multiplied by 100 so x upon 24 multiplied by 8 upon x multiplied 100 so 3 that is 100 upon 3 33 and one third percent so d is the right answer question number 10 following graph represent a number of shoes sold by a shopkeeper in last four months shoes shoes sold september 2 so friend september 2 october 1 2 3 November, November, 1, 2, 3, 4, and December, 1. Total, 10. So, after that, we go to the questions. What is the total number of shoes sold by software in 4 months? So, one picture represent 112 pair of shoes so here 10 picture so 10 picture represent 1 2 multiplied by 10 that is 1120 pair of shoes so a is the right answer thank you for watching have a good day